so now we have a test paper here and I have organized some simple questions to start with and as we progress these questions will become difficult and difficult and then we'll have some thinking questions and bonus questions now this one is rate of change and we are looking into volume of a cube the question is the edge of a cube is expanding at a rate of 3 centimeters per second at what rate is the volume changing when the edge is 10 centimeter and when the volume is 1 meter cube so you can pause the video find your solution and then look into my suggestion now here we know let the edge be s centimeter we say let edge be s centimeters then what is going to be the volume then volume v will be equals to s cube is it okay now we want to find rate of change of volume now both the quantities are related and that's why we have related rates now so dv over dt gives us the rate of change of volume with respect to time and when we differentiate this we get 3 times s square ds over dt right so that is the relation which connects volume with the edge rate of change right now what do we need to find we need to find at what rate is volume changing when the edge is 10 centimeters so when we know edge is 10 centimeter we can find the rate knowing the rate of change of edge which is also known to us so it is known to us that the edge is expanding at a rate of 3 centimeters per second so let's write down this known thing which is we know that ds dt is equals to 3 centimeters per second now the two parts are one when edge is 10 centimeters so that we can find straight away that is part a so what is dv dt when s is equals to 10 centimeters so we'll just plug in 10 here for s and 3 for ds dt so we get 3 times 10 square times ds dt is 3 centimeters per second so we'll write just 3 here and we'll consider the units later, right? We could have written units here also. S 10 centimeters. So centimeter square and this centimeter makes it cube, correct? Right? Well, we can write here centimeter cube per second, right? That takes care of all of them. Now that gives us the answer, which is 3 times 3 is 9 and 100. So it is 900 centimeter cube per second for part A. Now for part B, it says when the volume is 1 meter. So what do you understand by volume equals to 1 meter cube? So we have to find what is the edge when the volume is 1 meter cube, right? So I find this is kind of tricky, right? 1 meter cube means 1 meter times 1 meter times 1 meter. Why I'm doing this, I think it is important to do. And every meter is 100 centimeters. So it is 100 centimeter cube. Do you understand? So when we say 1 meter cube, then each edge length is actually 100 centimeters. So at this time, we know S is equals to 100 centimeters. When volume is equals to 1 meter cube. Right? So convert the units properly and then use your formula. So the formula is dv dt is equals to 3 times s square so s for us is 100 this time 100 so let me use the units inside and show you how the units really convert to square and ds dt is 3 centimeter per second so we got 3 and the units are centimeters per second correct now let's multiply this and get our answer of part b so 100 this 3 times 3 is 9 and this is 100 square that means one two three four right units are centimeter cube per second do you understand so that is how we get part b so our answer for part a is when the edge is doing this then it is 900 centimeter cube per second and when the volume is one meter cube at that time the rate at which volume is changing is 90,000 centimeter cube per second okay so that's how you need to do this question. Thank you and all the best.